All right, this is the seventh video in my Stonewood Endurance Castle series. And in this one, we are gonna build Amp D South. Uh, so for me, my Amp D is the Southeastern Amp down there, um, but everyone's Amp D is gonna be different uh, because in Stonewood, you can choose where you wanna place your Flex Amp. So for me, I put mine up on this hill over here. Um, and others of you may have this one right here or that Amp down there. But my video series is only going to cover the amp D being up here. All right. Uh, hopefully you guys have learned enough from watching my videos that you'll be able to adjust and build your own defenses uh, for these amps. And you know, if you need help, you can always just post in the comments or, or um, you know, maybe I can come and take a look at your your base and see if I can help out if I have the time. Um, but anyways, okay. So amp D. Uh, this is a huge pain in the ass amp. Uh, right? Everything bad during the endurance uh, happens to this amp. So the tornadoes hit this amp, the lava spots hit this amp, the mini bosses with the mist pods hit this amp. So, um, you know, you've got a lot of randomness that can happen. And uh, so if the tornado like wipes out your lava shield or destroys all your traps in your tunnel, or the lava spots wipe out parts of your trap tunnels, then uh, you're going to fail, right, before you get to the, the end rounds. Um, so the way I've designed this amp, and the reason why it looks so weird and like almost like it's half built, um, is to protect against those types of things, right? The tornado destroys floor traps and ceiling traps, and that's why you don't see any floor traps or ceiling traps here. Um, and then the way I have these connected tiles, like the floor there, floor there, and stuff like that, is because um, I put my base here, and that will protect this entire area, plus this entire lava shield, and my trap tunnel down there, from the tornado. Because everything covered by the base will not be destroyed by the tornado. So, um, that's why yeah, I mean, it's designed the way it's designed. Um, okay, so let's start with... Um, it's just here. Let's just okay, come to this amp, and this will be our, our starting landmark. Okay. So, um, from the amp D, come over here and go down this this ramp here. This is going to be the start of our trap tunnel. And we're only in this video. We're only going to build up to up to here, even though we've sort of merged the south defense with the east defense in the way that I've designed the trap tunnels. Let's just um, build up to this point here to keep the video from being too long. And then I'll cover the rest of it in the next one. Okay, so when you're down here, you've got this little ramp up here. We have to block this off. Um, and we cannot use this whole area right here because there is a lava spot here, which ends up destroying your like entire trap tunnel here. Okay, so we're gonna block this off. Just put a, a wall with a wall dart and a floor. Um, don't worry about this ceiling and lava shield. We'll get to it after we've done the, the trap tunnel. Okay, so now come to this double ramp right here. And we are going to put a second wall, standard sound wall, triple, triple dura, double reload, heels attached, and a wall with a wall dart over here. Okay, now we're starting to come up the, the ramp, and we've got a floor with an electric field on it right there. Uh, full wall dynamo, full wall wall dart, full wall dynamo. And look above it, got a blank full wall, a wall dart above that, and another full wall right there. And then we've got a tire drop trap with the muffler in this corner because we want to push them down, just like in our other places, you know, in our other um, videos. Alright, so come up after we've got that, come up here. We've got a, a floor of the ceiling electric, a wall. Behind this wall, we've got a cone. Okay, because we're blocking them from going up that half. All right, and look this way. We've got full wall dynamo, low wall dynamo. You can see the, the dart that we had already placed. And then another tire drop trap with, again, the muffler position. Okay, when we get up here, the reason why this is all looks wonky and half-built and no ceilings and floors is because of uh, 
the tornado and also there's a lava spot right here and this lava spot ends up breaking everything here and here also even if you put a cone here this lava spot will break it so there's no point in putting a cone here okay we'll we'll get to that um this area in a sec so let's just continue this way we've got three of old arts right there and then if you remember, this is the block off that we had for A South. We've got that wall launcher right here. Um, I did end up putting some walls here to, to catch the random spawner that comes up here. So just put a wall with a heels attached wall spike here, another wall with a heels attached wall spike here, and then a wall with a wall dart here. Okay. So let's continue this way. Put another wall dart on this side. A full wall with a wall dart here. And then this is the path they're going to take to our amp. They're going to come to this tile right here to try to destroy your amp. So, um, all right, you got that. And then we've got a mid wall with a dynamo here, mid wall with a dynamo here. A mid wall is just uh, two layers like this, not, not the low wall. And the reason I chose the mid wall is because I want the walls to have more life to protect against the tornado. Um, and also, uh, if when I AFK, I'm a constructor, so I'll start the endurance, come over this way, put my base on that tile right over there, but I don't have triple jump as a constructor, so I want to come jump over this wall, jump over this wall, get over there. Okay, so um, I use mid walls for, for here. Mid wall dynamo, mid wall dynamo. Put a wall dart on that wall right there. This is just I just boxed up the the amp, so just you know box it up like you normally would box up all the sides of the amp. Wall right there. Broadside here, broadside here. Okay. So if the tornado does wipe out a number of your traps, you know, the drop traps there and stuff and things start to get by, your base will protect these tiles right here. And um, everything will die to to these to these traps when they get there. Alright? Okay, I'll cover the rest of all of that in the next video, so just uh, don't worry about it for now. Okay, so then come this way and let's finish this uh, ceiling and lumber shield. Alright, so you have this tile so far. Okay, so, so one tile forward, and then let's build two tiles this way to this corner. Okay, so now we're on this corner. So, so far you've built that, 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 this, right? So now we're going to go... One more, and two more here, and then we're gonna go one here, 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 one more here, and one more here. And now you should be ending up flush with this cliff right here. Okay. All right. And then all you just need is to build a, a ramp, like this, on the edge here. So just go across this edge, building a single ramp on each of those, all the way across, okay? And then, you know, you, you can just double check. This edge on this side should line up with you know, that little cliff over there. You've got your wall launcher there, and now this cliff right here, this should line up, okay? And that's your lava shoot. And you know, possibly the main defense for here. Because the tornado doesn't doesn't wipe out these electrics. It, it wipes out the ones over on that side. All right, so now we're just going to put a bunch of electrics on, on this. So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, right there. So we've got these six so far. OK, come this way. You, you don't need one right up there. So. Now you just need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more, and you do not need one on that, that corner right there. Okay, so you should have a total of one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Right? Okay, and that should be good for this part of the amp defense. I know it seems a little like it's half finished, 
um, this video because the way I've designed it, I sort of merged the east um, defense with the south defense, but I don't want this video to be too long. So I'll cover the rest of it in the next video. And then also in the next video, I will have the, the clip of the amp um, in action since you kind of need both sides to be built um, to really see it in action with like the tornadoes and the, the lava. So um, I'll, I'll do that in the next video. All right.